but that's just not enough. Uh, we need. Yeah. Professor's notes. Yes. Uh, yeah. Take a look at these notes. They're from Professor Hartridge, Tulane University. Yeah. What about them? They confirm that the pattern from the murders is of African origin. Hmm. This is interesting. If true. But how do you the know that the, the woman right is now listening in? How do you know it's the right pattern? Because you gave him the pattern. Yes. So I will give him this then. <laughs> yeah. You know those marks you found around the murder victims? This is a reconstruction. Pretty much, we've been doing your job for you, Mosley. <laughs> what makes you think this is an accurate reconstruction? Well, I borrowed <laughs> the patterns from your police file and did my own tracing of the pattern. They didn't ask me yesterday. An architectural oh, artist no, reconstructed no. from the partials. All you have to do is read the next so line. That's what Hartley used. Right? Right, gotcha. <laughs> yes, his analysis on time. It's for dweebs. Okay. It is for dweebs. The murders were committed Fucking by a legitimate voodoo cult. You proved your point. All right, oh, we got okay, one at the tree. One down. Okay. So next one then. Uh, oh, what about Crash's tattoo? No, no huh? I took this tracing from a tattoo on Crash's chest. It's related to the underworld voodoo cult. Yeah. What makes you think that? It's what Crash said just before he died. Well, he was probably hallucinating from the drugs he OD'd on. Probably got that in the Navy or something. Snake bracelet? No, no. I'm sure it's, it's related. related. It's a legitimate homicidal threat. And even if it were a scene, mm. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 They killed the four. They'll kill again. Legit voodoo code. Basically, we're trying to force Mosley into actual work. That's this is, is what we're doing. Here. Yeah. Oh, it this is. is a newspaper oh. clipping about a murder committed in 1810. That murder is an exact match of the voodoo murders. This right undeniable proof here. The mm, no. <laughs> this does sound like the same MO. 1810? 1810. They killed then. They're killing now. Isn't that proof that they're likely to kill again? That they are a threat? Okay. They're a threat. They still have you really have to like, all right, fine. Now, do right. we have a lead is the question. Well, what physical evidence have you picked up from the crime scene? The snakeskin. Snake. But we don't have a snakeskin to... This is a lot. Well, we should show them the snakeskin anyway. The scale. I picked up this scale at Lake Punch of Train. Yeah? Well, what makes you think it's related to the murders? Well, it was at the crime scene. Hang on. Sure. It must be from the only snake in Louisiana, all right? That voodoo snake. Christ. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Does he have I... any scales on him from being attacked by... Don't get personal. Damn it. That's what I was thinking. Uh. I even used a magnifying glass. There's nothing on my... <laughs> <laughs> You into that yourself one. up to a dick joke there. Yeah, yeah, I did, I did. What a snake bracelet. I have this snake bracelet. It's a replica of one used in secret voodoo ceremonies a few decades ago. Really? What makes you think so? I got it from an old Creole lady whose grandmother was a pack of married. Back to the bookshop! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright then. We don't need to know. By the way, the two of you are dead on. Just with the scale. Well, yeah. I'll be seeing you. Later, oh, I oh, yeah. Grace oh, Grace sees, sees it. it. Yeah. yeah. Grace sees it. Yeah. Of course, of course, we have to talk to Grace and say, "I was attacked, and not by a woman." By a snake. You don't know what that's like, what do you, Grace? Who? Me? Oh yeah, of course. Uh, we just took off uh, our coat. Well, you're kind of a pale green color. We're just covered in scales. <laughs> Pale green, you say? Charming. What's that, that on your face? Uh, I'm sure you'll tell me. Looks like a sparkly or something. Got it. I love it when you pick stuff off my face, Grace. <laughs> <laughs> well, excuse me. Okay. There's something. Something in the ashtray. Hang on. Those two. Those two. 
Sweet Jesus. You could do this. I know, I've got it, I've got it. You're not there. as bad as me, still. Yeah. <laughs> it's a sweet <gasps> yeah, it's, the it's the same one. The same fucking scale. Looks like the Python left me. So it was Dr. John Snake that's been uh, doing the murders. That's well, what he was calls actually it. at the crime scene. Yes. And that's how you get your lead. Yes. But I need to confirm. Got some things that need to be mm. at the same. Have fun. Yeah, that, I'll we'll do that when we get to the police station. Woohoo! Well, we're gonna get those sons of bitches! <laughs> what do you know about voodoo, Bark Bark? Loads now. <laughs> I could write a lecture on it. They actually look exactly the same. A lecture that you can follow. Gabriel, man, look fine. Alright, right, so that's the one from the lake. Five uh, out of five naps. Back the cottage. <laughs> Yeah. The it should be like a one and the two beside the uh, like two the logo, the image. Matches the scale from Lake Pontchartrain. We can see that. Together. Fucking ding, ding, uh. ding. <laughs> What's even better is that. I took me like if a you find second. Find the radar code. Yeah. If you go back and replay the game, you can actually translate the radar code. The work, the yeah, and see what's going yeah, on. Yeah. Yeah. What is it, you wanker? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, uh, that's the second time he's called us that. There we go. I have these two snake scales. One's from the crime scene at Lake Pontchartrain. The other's from a snake in the Voodoo Museum on Ursulines and Charters. Is this common? They all look alike? Not at all. They're both constricted scales, and the coloring is the same. A python's coloring is. We know that because we read a book on the snakes in our bookstore. That's right. Hardly an indigenous snake to Louisiana. Somehow, somewhere, mm. the Voodoo Museum's python was at the scene of the Lake Pontchartrain murder. Well, I call that a lead, all right. Certainly suggests certain lines of inquiry at the museum. Not bad work, eh? If we can tie them into this voodoo cult, we just might have something. Fantastic. Okay. Now reopen the case. We did it! Hey, we did it, guys! Let's... I'll go out for beers. Well, you know what they Let's say. go to Napoleon and beat this water comes to chess. Well, point taken. Glad I could inspire you. I'm enjoying this game. Yeah, <laughs> it, it's bubbling up nice, nicely, isn't it? Yeah, I'm so excited. What's gonna happen next? Mm. Wobble, 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 wobble. <laughs> Look at him. He's so hyped to reopen the case and do all them paperworks. Sweet, delicious paperworks. Oh, the scared. cops have and the cops Shut. have assembled. They're immobilized now, it's ready to go. Now, lay low and let me handle this. Tony's not impressed. No. Yeah, fine. Mm hmm. Outstanding. It's getting late. That, that was a long day, in fairness. Yeah. Saw a man die? Yeah. You know, that, that, that takes a lot out of you. Nearly that was like one of the first. Nearly died ourselves, yeah, absolutely. Fucking Dr. John, man. He's dodgy. Dodgy boy. He might be the DJ from the Voodoo Code. I was thinking that myself, actually, Dr. yeah. Dr. John, DJ. With the Conclave, you see, that's the intriguing part. He was before the Conclave. Maybe he's the one orchestrating it. And no answer. Mm. You're sleeping alone tonight, buddy. Dang it. Any Did nightmares? Get... Yeah, we're getting oh, a nightmare. We're getting a nightmare. Well, we can. You just can't quite hear it. So, what, what new details are coming out in this one? There's Gunter. You know that's Gunter, isn't that? That's Ted, Oh. Yeah. Yeah. He's tra transforming. Oh, we've got boobies. Circle within a circle. Uh, that was mentioned in the... Uh, yeah. The spiel. There's a talisman. Horn blood. Mm -hmm. we got this squirrely... Oh, the three snakes, yeah. yeah. And it's still coming back to us. Oh, snake. Yeah. 
So there was a little bit of detail in there. It was a circle within a circle. Because I think the, yeah. the professor did mention that. It's the home for one. Yes. And then night came day, I glimpsed at nature's reddest claw. And the face of fear looked back at me as I gazed into its maw. Ma. Mm. Ma. Ma. I think I say it there. Dear you say me? So. I just bet into this. I'm gonna get some, some snackage. Oh, okay. Fuck yeah. Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh no, I missed it. There's a dead bird here. Ah, uh, it's dying. Dying bird. Look, look at this shit. Oh, gross. Yeah, how about that? Kill it. What is, what's wrong? Gabriel? Look, I see it, Brett. Look, he's gone. There's no one in the shop, and I know there's no one in back. It's okay. Okay? Gabriel, that thing is still barely alive. How could someone do this? With a knife, maybe? God, don't even start. We should call the police. Grace, it's slightly hysterical. I don't know how to cross here. But, Gabriel. I said, I'll take care of it. I'm gonna come in with some half dead chicken and some covered in blood all over your fucking floor. Yeah. Over our nice carpets. They know where you live now. Shh. It's gonna be fine. Now go on. And later. Later. <laughs> I don't want to go home. I could close the shop today. No. I'd rather keep busy. I'll be fine. Oh, the creepy guy's gone. Yeah. He transformed into the chicken. <laughs> okay. Let's have a... Horoscopes. Oh yeah, for, of course. How foolish of me. You got the verb right this time. Or just about. Shut. I saw what you first. Shut the fuck. <laughs> you saw a fucking nothing woman. Gabriel finds an article about That's Saint Jean Vive. Which is today. It discusses the day's Catholic rule and its adoption by voodoo devotees. In the early to mid 1800s. They're not bad actually, Sarah Cream. They're just Sarah Cream. Was celebrated with elaborate voodoo gatherings at Lake Pontchartrain, Bayou Saint Jean and other sites outside the city. These days, the day is commemorated commercially That's, um, in some Lucas. of the local shops. He'll have to hear and my accent. And a few churches <laughs> still hold the St. John's Vigma. Yeah. Despite his better judgment, Gabriel reads... You're gonna die! Today what the fuck? <laughs> your life will change forever. <laughs> Why not? Right. As you can see, the horoscope is getting a bit um, forward. Literally everyone in the corner in one month. You're all dead. Messages. Do you have messages for me? Nope. None right now. Sad face. Could you do some research for me? Chicken sure. dishes. <laughs> can you think of okay. something for like chicken tikka masala? Who do you talk? Oh. Uh, Ogum Madagaris. Ogun Badagri mean anything to you? No. Sorry. And we done that ballad already. So let's go out for a wander, shall we? Unless Oh maybe we can talk to uh, Wolfgang. Actually. Now that we have actually read his journal. It would be nice if he actually, you know, re responded to him at some point. So you remember? Gabriel never has figured out how to operate your Thanks, Sierra. You fucking pricks. I know the end of it. So just need to. F yeah, 405. Yeah, that's what it is. No. I can't afford to call Germany again until I figure all this out. Uh -huh. Eat a dick, Gabriel. Right. I am the I am the player. You will do as I say. Go so grace the snake tattoo. Okay. Oh yes, we're going to a party. Yeah. Why well, use the tattoo trick? On the desk. Yes. How foolish of me. Carve my new symbol into it. Yes. What? Use your paints to cover this snake tattoo onto my chest. Now, why on earth would you want me to do that? I'm going to a party tonight. Costume, you know. You don't say. I guess you're going with Maya. Oh, no, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> She's so jealous and so cute. I ain't like Maria. Well, if you're jealous about my feelings for her, that's exactly what this is. No, that's not it. I just think, as your friend, that she's trouble. She's also a bitch. 
I know you have certain feelings for me, quite naturally. Me? You know for a fact that like, Gabriel dreams every night of her and Malia mud wrestling for his affection. Yeah. No chance to avoid hearing about it, seeing it day by day. Fine, I'll do it. Just shut up. Can we at least go in the back? Sure, but. 